Oh, we started! <laughs> you didn't tell me. I was too busy looking at Facebook. Anyway. Hello. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not reading that yet. The farewell. Oh, already? I've known them for like two seconds. Let's go. I feel like I know them so well. <laughs> <laughs> Hope Hospital, Nurses Station. And so, since my husband has been relocated to a different office, I'll be leaving oh, Hope Hospital <laughs> effective immediately. I won't say that. I'm really going to miss this place and all the friends I made here, but I promise to continue my work as a nurse wherever life takes me. You've taught... You've all taught me, no me that nothing is more important than satisfying men. It's a pleasure to have you on staff, Mary. Good luck with the new job. I can't believe you're leaving. This is all so sudden. Thank you for removing my fingers. You're an incredible surgeon, Dr. Stiles. How are you going to get by without her, Derek? <laughs> Actually, Derek's the one reason I was a little hesitant to leave. Are you two fucking? I even spoke with my husband about it. I told him there was this kid who depends on me. He asked how long I'd been working in pediatrics. <laughs> oh, come on. I'm not that bad. <laughs> you wanna do this? You do, don't you? Go. Mm. Hold on, boys. Come on, you can do it. It's Nurse Fulton here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello, Dr. Hoffman. I'm not interrupting anything. Am I? Robert Hoffman, age 62, the director and founder of Hope Hospital. He used to be a renowned surgeon, but now he's just a drunk. No, no, of course not. I came to say goodbye. <laughs> Since I won't be around tomorrow, I'm going to die. <laughs> <laughs> it happens in every man's life. Thank you for many years of dedicate. You're a fantastic nurse. Probably our best. On behalf of our entire staff, I'd like to say thank you. Oh, sir! There's other ways you could thank me. But I wish there was some way I could thank you for, ye for you for this opportunity. Well, you're not going to stop nursing, are you? And I mean nursing with apostrophes. Even though I meant quotation marks. <laughs> I haven't done English in 40 years. You can <laughs> if you continue to fork... <laughs> Of course, sir. Helping people is my life. It's just... I wish I could stay and learn from you a little longer. Don't be modest. Doggy style? Anyone can teach you that! I can't put the voice anymore, I lost it. <laughs> I'm afraid Dr. Cassell surpassed me as a surgeon. Long ago... Dr. Huffman. <laughs> I, I, I just imagine Derek Styles now just stood here just going... <laughs> what? <laughs> You're looking for a new job. I want to be a stranger, all right. At any rate, you're so quiet. <laughs> I have other matters to attend to. You'll excuse me. You're gonna be so quiet. Go closer to the mic. Everyone, I'm gonna voice is gonna be creepy. I wish I could be seen, Doctor Hoffman, in action more often. I'm really bad at reading. But he hasn't performed any operation since that incident. Derek, let's discuss the next patient. Yes, sir. This will be my last procedure at Hope. Make sure he doesn't die, Derek. <laughs> and if he does, blame it on Gasol. Neil Spence. Spence. Multiple tumours. Bloody hell. Confirmed in the pancreas. What is the pancreas used for? Hmm. You did biology and you did learn about the pancreas. I want you to handle Mr. Spence's operation today. In another tumour excision. Just be careful, there's more than one this time. Make sure you don't miss any. This is the last time I'll be assisting you, Dr. Styles. If you can handle this operation, I'll feel much better about leaving. Uh, da, 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 da. Died. Oh, dot dot dot. I didn't mean to upset you. My God, stop it! Oh, don't what burp into us. Don't burp into us patient's stomach. They don't like that. The only person you should be thinking about during operations is the patient. Do you understand? Y yeah, ma'am. Yeah, ma'am. Yeah, ma'am. Let's review the main objective for today's operation. Exercise, exercise, and then we'll pull two of us from the patient's pancreas. Make sure he's running on that treadmill. Now, think back to yesterday's procedure. Here goes. Let's begin the operation.
I accidentally just put my hand in his mouth. <laughs> it's okay, he likes that shit. He's from the 60s. It's actually 2018. God. <laughs> Let's begin. Let's begin. Um, give me goodie bow gel. Uh, scalpel. No. <laughs> I'll give you the ultra. Fuck. <laughs> Sorry. I'll give you the ultrasound, mate. Fuck you, know, that's a weird punk. Uh, I need. Apparently, I need a blue vial. Okay. Blue vial. Direct and normally, no injection to the inflammation. Oh damn. Uh, three tumors have been identified. Uh, ultrasound. Uh, give me the scalpel. Uh, the drain. Bottom right. Black that out. Uh, the scalpel. Come on. I won't let this patient die! Oh god, he's. he's, he's syringe. Uh, not syringe. Uh, uh, forceps. He's dropping fast, doctor. Goop. I'm gonna call it goop because it's easier than biogel. Goop. Uh, right. Ultrasound. Scalpel. He's dying, doctor. Um. Drain. Uh, he's, scalpel. He's, he's, I've got this going. Have you got, have you got the pattern yet? No. <laughs> Four steps. Patterns ain't my thing, boy. Bye, Joe. Have a syringe. Syringe. Can you give him some life. Uh, is, this, is, this, is this how hospitals work? <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> gone in Japan. Yeah, right, right, right. Uh, drain. Dra drain. Scalpel. Scarpa! Doctor, you're, you're cutting in the wrong place! <laughs> you're cutting in arteries! <laughs> um, what's that? Stop, what are you doing? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> you just dropped some paper in it. Yeah, man. Mate, fucking did it. Uh, soup, uh, soup chis. Stick to the main one. Oh, he's doing it properly. <laughs> No, I'll yeah, put one in his arm. There you go. <laughs> Just, oh my god, I'm attached! Uh, bio gel. Alright, I'm gonna take that. Stop! <laughs> but I'm blaming you, stop! Well done. You know I died! <laughs> Is that his stomach or his back? Uh, stomach. He didn't have no belly button. Uh, yeah, no. What a freak. What's the belly button? What's the belly button? Yeah. You did a great job, there. It looks like I have nothing to worry about. You're gonna make an excellent surgeon. Please continue to use your abilities and help the people of Angela's Bay. She thinks she's better than you. Because <laughs> she is. Nurse Angie. Ooh, are you ready to see Nurse Angie? <laughs> is she hot? It's to get no. Don't look in the booklet. You can't see who she is. Damn. Start this episode. Is she on the front. Is that her? That's Nicola Weaver. Nicola. Nicola. Nozomi. Nikolai. <laughs> Nozomi. She's from Japan. Who's Angie? Uh, and so we felt you deserved a special gift of appreciation. Thank you for 18 years of service, dedicated, dedicated service, Mrs. Fulton. Hey, oh what to my say. Christ! I'm a little embarrassed. <laughs> Mrs. Fulton was more than a great nurse, she looked after us as well. And not in the ways of Germaline. She will be missed. Are you sure you're not glad to be free of my nagging? Yes, but... <laughs> what well, now you mention it! What are you talking I'm just worried. Derek's going to start coming to work late again. He is depressed. <laughs> <laughs> you're the one who kept him in line, Mary. I really need to stop that glue. <laughs> oh, jeez, I'm standing right here, guys. I don't care! You don't need to worry. I'll be fine without Mary's help. It's Nurse Fulton to you! I may be young, but I'm still a doctor. That's good to hear! So, no more stopping phone calls for what you, What even huh? is Derek's problem? <laughs> what? I wasn't crying. I'm just teasing, Derek. Ah, you've grown up too much since you joined us. I'm proud of you. Work hard and you'll even surpass Dr. Casal one day. Don't forget that I believe in you! I believe in you! Do you want to be this nurse? No, you lost the character, there's all you'll be a character. She is a new year! Is something wrong? They must be talking about my replacement! Since you're leaving, you're going to need a new assistant. I was supposed to train her this afternoon, but HR assumed me that she's very reliable. I hope everything's okay. Alright, I get to be a different character now. No, I want to be a... Because one of my no, characters is going. No, I mean, 
Sorry I'm late. Sorry I'm late. She's a cockney. Hello. I'm Angie Thompson, the new nurse. I'll be starting here tomorrow. Angie Thompson, age 21. It appears she's from... 21? Oh, oh, new, 21? <laughs> Angie is part German. Born into a very intelligent family. Do you know what else is part German? Right. Next episode again, this gaming. And me. And you, but that doesn't count. Oh, I never count. Oh, I was about to whisper into the mic. Look at my cobbler! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>